what, what the lady is talking about. What's up, family? T.K. Kirkland was recently on The Breakfast Club and he made some rather colorful comments regarding sex. What did T.K. say? T.K. said, sex, love is for men who have accomplished something. He wasn't done. He took it a step further. T.K. said that if you ain't got at least $25,000 in the bank, you don't deserve sex. What do you think about that, fam? Is TK right or wrong? If you ain't got at least $25,000 in the bank, you don't deserve sex. Now I've known TK for a long time and TK has never bitten his tongue. He's always said what was on his mind and he's always offered you know, very, very good advice through the years. TK give you that information and instructions to help you navigate through this wild, crazy, beautiful world. But right here, I think he's wrong. I think he's wrong on this one. First of all, I wouldn't have even been born. <laughs> $25,000 in the bank? Now, I understand, I guess you gotta consider inflation and stuff like that, and, you know, growth, learning, you know, evolving, and all that kind of stuff. But $25,000 sounds like a tall task just to be able to have sex. You know, 25 in the bank, that's a lot of money. I kind of get where he's going though, because I kind of feel this, I feel the same way when it comes to having sex and finances, right? Like even before my kids were born, I knew I had to get some money. I didn't want to bring kids into the world and put them at a social disadvantage because I understood my lot in life. The reason why I was the way I was and going through a lot of things that I went through when I was younger is because of insufficient living. Insufficient living can bring on a lot of other things that are insufficient. Insufficient love, insufficient clothing, insufficient uh, education, you know, a, a lot of things you know, come with that, right? Uh, so I wanted to make sure I had my money right. Not just to have kids, for kids to enjoy and, 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 and so they can have nice things, but I wanted to make sure that I didn't deny myself some nice things along the way. So I get where he's coming from with that. But these type of statements to me uh, tend to demonize the poor. It kind of comes off as the elite looking down on the poor. And I'm not with that. I'm not with that at all. Uh, because, you know, before TK got to the money, you know, he, I'm pretty sure uh, he didn't have any money, which meant that he wouldn't have gotten any action. Um, I believe this is the way I operate. I don't care about sex when my money ain't right. When I'm not getting money, like if, if I don't feel accomplished, I really don't, I'm really not feeling sex like that. I'm not interested in sex like that. I don't even like pursue women. I feel uncomfortable, you know, not having my money right, not being able to do simple things like, I don't know, buy a two-piece chicken at Popeye's or something, you know? Like, you know, simple things, fam, just simple things, you know? Uh, I think at the very least, on a personal note, a man has to be able to take care of himself, you know, besides being able to take care of your hygienic needs and stuff like that and feed yourself or whatever, a man got to be able to put a roof over his head and, and, and pay his bills and things of that nature. I just feel like that. That's the way I feel. And if I can't do that, if I'm having an issue with that, I can't get excited about sex. I just, that's me. Now, I'm sure a lot of cats out there, hey man, they can, they ain't got to be able to rub two pennies together and they cool, but I'm not like that. So I get what he's saying in that regard, but as far as 25K being the, the benchmark for whether you can have sex or not. That's the bar. I'm like, ah, who came up with that number? Like, like, did he sit down 
And uh, what number? What's a good number? What's a good threshold to reach in order for you to be deserving of sex? What's a good threshold? Another thing is that it takes two to tango. And so what do you do about the women out there who don't require a man to have a job? <laughs> who don't require a man to have one dollar and will gladly give him sex just because he looks good. He got some nice hair. <laughs> you know, uh, he got muscles. Uh, I don't know, fam. You know how I go. You know, like, you know, is there any responsibility for those women? Because if they are putting out, I'm pretty sure that there will be no shortage of broke guys who will be willing to put in. Catch my drift. But let me know what you think about this, fam. To have sex or not, under 25K. Sounds like a book. No more talk. What the ladies talking about? Damn.